Right now, Milwaukee police are searching for who shot and killed a 31 year old woman, Cache Henderson. Her body was found in an apartment near 29th and Villard after a fire on Sunday. A Milwaukee nonprofit group called Diverse and Resilient says she was a black trans woman. Her death ruled a homicide by the Milwaukee County Medical Examiner's Office. So now police are investigating the death of Henderson, who's the third black trans woman to be killed in the past eight months here in Milwaukee alone. And today, TMJ4's Bruce Harrison spoke with two women to learn more about Henderson, who she was, and the dangers trans women live with. Being shot, being stabbed. A lot. I went through it all. I have been through it all. Monet Evans says for many trans women, there's a dangerous balance between living as yourself and surviving others. I'm standing strong. One day in my life, I just was like, I have to know when to stay, when to go, what to say, what to do, because I got to make it home. Evans now shares her experience with young trans women as a peer navigator in Milwaukee NGO, diverse and resilient. In the summertime, if you see a group of people right there and you already know, turn around, go the other way. And it's not all about being scared. It's, nothing. it's about making it home with not a scratch on you. Evans, like Henderson's family, doesn't know why she died. According to the Milwaukee LGBT Community Center, there were 38 trans deaths nationally last year and six murders reported so far this year. On Sunday, police say Henderson was shot in a fire then set in her apartment. Like even Cache even posted things on her Facebook page about, you know, a lot of her fellow transgender friends die, I'm sorry. Henderson's cousin, Veronica Beck, says they want justice, not another unsolved murder. How do you want Cache to be remembered? I want her to be remembered for her bubbly, giving spirit, giving spirit. I want her to be remembered for her confidence, you know, the confidence that she she def deflected or reflected on other people, the confidence she gave other people to be their true, genuine self. Evans, for Henderson and others killed, wants to teach that confidence and also safety to anyone who will listen. I just want to live and have fun. I didn't survive. Now I got to live. I work for this. Reporting in Milwaukee, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News. Now, according to the LGBT Community Center, discrimination against trans people impacts their livelihood on a lot of things, including like access to jobs. We have links to resources with both the LGBT Community Center and Diverse and Resilient on our website, TMJ4.com.